So you're both well aware that one of Colorado's largest polluters is in the 8th Congressional District. It's the Suncor refinery. Ms. Kirkmeyer, what impact do you think Suncor has on the Coloradans who live nearby, primarily Coloradans of color? And what, if anything, should be done about the current situation around Suncor? Um, with regard to Suncor, I think they need to go through their permitting process, and I think the state health department needs to step up and get them through that process and make sure that they are following the rules and regulations. We have some of the most robust rules and regulations when it comes to air quality and water quality, environmental regulations in this state, in the nation. And I think that if the Department of, uh, department of Health were to step up and make sure that they are following those rules as they go through the permitting process, then the impact would be lessened, if at all, with regard to the neighbor and the surrounding neighborhood. So as Ms. Caraveo, as Ms. Kirk Kirkmeyer points out, a lot of the enforcement falls to uh, the state agencies. Mm -hmm. uh, but federal government, the EPA, have a role. In fact, they got involved in Suncor's permitting process to say that they were unsatisfied with the way that things were going. What would you like to see happen at Suncor and in the surrounding neighborhoods? We need to make sure that we are watching the emissions that are coming from Suncor and a lot of other um, uh, polluters um, out there. I can tell you that when I was little, I grew up down the street, um, downwind um, from Suncor. Um, as a pediatrician, I have seen the effects that bad air quality days have on children. I can look out and see the haze that is over Denver, and I know that that day I'm going to be sending kids to the hospital because they're gonna have trouble breathing. Suncor needs to be regulated appropriately. The EPA has a huge role in that, and I should point out um, that my opponent has not has said that the EPA just needs to go away. Um, there is going to be difficulty in enforcing the laws that she just talked about if we get rid of the federal agency that is in charge of enforcing those laws. Uh, we need to make sure that we're creating a living um, community um, for our kids in the future, and that includes regulating emissions.